Young children judge others based on facial features as much as adults do. The primary article that I looked at for this week was Children's Use Target's Facial Appearance to Guide and Predict Social Behavior. The goal was to conduct four experiments to address whether or not, and if so, when the facial traits of others start to shape children's and adults' judgments about others. They used 350 children and included some adults for comparison. The researchers say that this study is unique because it includes a wider age range in hopes of accounting for developmental shifts, and it also examines judgments from multiple face traits simultaneously. Experiments 1 and 2 looked at how face traits affected the judgments of behaviors of the targets, while experiments 3 and 4 looked at children's and adults' pro-social behaviors towards the targets based off of the facial traits. Specifically, Experiment 1 used computer-generated face stimuli to look at three face traits that varied on the appearance of trustworthiness, trustworthy or untrustworthy, dominance, dominant and submissive, and competence or competent and incompetent. The questions asked were similar to which look nice or mean and which one of these people would be able to pick up something heavy. The results for this experiment demonstrated that children as young as five years old can use face trait information to generate judgments about the relative likelihood of others' behavior. Experiment 2 examined whether children can also make behavior judgments from subtle faces to similar degrees as adults. The experimental design was the same as it was in Experiment 1, just using more subtle traits. The results of Experiment 2 were also almost identical to those of Experiment 1. In Experiment 3, children were then asked to give a gift to one of the faces on the screen. The faces were similar to ones shown in Experiment 1. An example of a question would be, this is Edgar and this is Martin. If you only had one cookie, which person would you give it to, Edgar or Martin? Overall, they found that children were much more likely to give the gift to the trustworthy or submissive face. Experiment 4 combined the prior experiments but only used faces varying in trustworthiness in only the first four gifts. Here, they found that, again, children were significantly more likely to choose the, un the expected trustworthy face. In conclusion, from at least the age of five, face trait information also guides children's judgments about how others will behave as well as children's decisions about how to behave towards others. The secondary article that I looked at was called Young Children Judge Others Based on Facial Features Just as Much as Adults Do. The article accurately described the background methods and results as well as included quotes from the author that helped to sum up the main purpose of the experiment and what sets it apart from others. Overall, I would give the secondary article five stars.